In this video, we're going to find the oxidation number for the chromium in the Cr207 2 minus ion. It's the dichromate ion. The 2 minus up here, that tells us that if we add up all these oxidation numbers here, it should equal minus 2. So we can put an equation here. We can start out by saying all of these are going to equal minus 2. We also know that oxygen, its oxidation number is minus 2, and we have 7 of them. So 7 times minus 2, that gives us a minus 14. At this point, when we look at our chromiums, we know that something plus minus 14, that'll give us the minus 2. We know that 12 plus minus 14, that gives us minus 2. So the chromiums, both of them, have a total oxidation number, you could say, of plus 12. But we're interested in the individual oxidation numbers. Since there's 2, we can just divide this 12 by 2, and that would give us plus 6 as the oxidation number for each of these chromiums in this Cr207 2 minus. You can set it up like an algebraic equation. You could have said 2x plus the minus 14 equals minus 2. And then you solve this again, you'll get that plus 6, which tells you that the chromium has an oxidation number of plus 6. This is Dr. B with the oxidation numbers for Cr207 2 minus the dichromate ion. And thanks for watching.